A federal lawsuit filed against a social media giant. It comes after a 10-year-old girl died participating in a TikTok challenge. Seanette Wilson reports. An attorney representing the family says that it wants to ensure that TikTok makes sure that the app can be used responsibly. Nyla was 10 years old uh, when in December uh, she died while attempting a dangerous viral TikTok challenge. This is Nyla Anderson. She's at the center of a wrongful death lawsuit filed on behalf of her family. That's the way the TikTok algorithm works. It knew that the user was a young child Yet despite that, it still was automatically sending her dangerous content that had no business ever being uh, put in front of a 10 year old. Jeffrey Goodman, a partner at the firm representing the family, says they filed the lawsuit today in federal court in Philadelphia. The family lives in Delaware County. He says what happened to Nyla on what he calls a dangerously popular app could happen to any child. The whole um, business model of TikTok is driven by their For You page. Uh, TikTok is not like YouTube where people search for videos. Instead, with TikTok, you see the videos that it puts in front of you. And the purpose of its algorithm is to try to get users hooked so that they view it more, so that they stay on longer. The purpose is to try to get users, and the users are often children, and to try to get them addicted. I contacted TikTok for comment. They provided this statement. This disturbing challenge, which people seem to learn about from sources other than TikTok, long predates our platform and has never been a TikTok trend. We remain vigilant in our commitment to user safety and would immediately remove related content if found. Our deepest sympathies go out to the family for their tragic loss. This is Nyla's mom, Tawana Anderson, at a conference today with attorneys. Goodman says they want to better understand TikTok's algorithm what happened, why, and to try to prevent it from happening again. Nyla's mother, Tawana, uh, spoke uh, a little bit earlier today. Uh, it is her goal to make sure that other families aren't put through what the Anderson family is going through right now. For more information on TikTok's community guidelines and safety center, you can go to fox29.com. Seanette Wilson, Fox 29 News.